Draw this panel on the screen. We are going to start with our horizontal line first. Please make sure all your drawings are made with thin lines. Please, then we draw our vertical line like this. Our vertical line. Now we are going to pick our 60 degrees square like this and draw to angle 60 degree to the horizontal like this. Then draw angle 30 degree to this other parts like this like this so now we are going to be picking our compass we are going to be picking the length of 20 millimeter as you can see this place is 40 millimeter on the diagram so i'm going to pick 20 millimeter on my compass like this then i'll place it at this particular point here and mark 20 here then mark another 20 millimeter here now i'm going to be drawing at angle 30 degree parallel to the initial 30 degree angle i drew to the horizontal so i'm going to draw it like this like this and like this so now what we are going to be doing is as we can see the these particular curves here they are at radius of 50 millimeter so now i'm going to pick my compass at 50 millimeter radius i'm going to pick my compass at 50 millimeter radius now i'm going to be placing my compass at this particular point and i place it at this point i'm going to be marking this particular line here so from this line here which is this place i'm going to be drawing like this please make use of thin lines then i'm going to draw another arc to this edge like this so making use of 50 millimeter radius now, now as we can see in this particular place the radius is actually radius 32 millimeter so in order to draw that we are going to be picking 32 minus 50 which is this initial one which is 18 i'm going to piece 18 on my compass and place it at this point then at this particular point where it meets this place i'll mark this place then from that point i'm going to be picking 32 millimeter on my compass like this picking 32 millimeter on my compass i'll place it at this particular point here then draw an arc like this then draw an arc like this so we are going to be doing exactly the same for this particular place we can see that the radius of this place is 38 and 38 minus 50 is actually 12 so i'm going to pick 12 on my on my compass like this 12 and place it at this point then i mark like this then i mark this place now i'm going to be picking 38 millimeter so from that point 38 millimeter like this like this so from this particular point i'm going to be drawing 38 millimeter like this so it's going to be like this like this so now what we are going to be doing is we are going to be drawing this particular plate so now in order to draw this particular curve here i'm going to be picking 18 millimeter from this particular point here then i would mark this point like this then i'm going to pick 12 millimeter also on my compass like this then place it at this place and mark here also let's extend this 18 18 millimeter like this and mark here so now we are going to be picking 50 millimeter from this particular point we are going to pick 15 millimeter on our compass like this then from this point here i'm going to be drawing my curve like this so now we are going to be taking thickening out the needed places so now we are going to be drawing the handle of the spanner in order to draw that we are told the handle of the spanner has a radius of 15 millimeter so i'm going to be picking 15 millimeter up and also 15 millimeter down like this then using my t square please make use of faint lines i'm going to draw a straight line like this then another 
straight line like this now we are told that the distance from this place to the end of the spanner is actually 200 millimeter so i'm going to pick 200 millimeter length that like this from this particular point here to this place i have to extend it a little bit like this now i'm going to place my my square square here then draw so now placing my compass at the center of this line i'm going to pick a radius of 15 millimeter and draw like this so that is that for the end of the spanner now we are going to be drawing this particular place here in order to draw that we have been given this place to have a radius of 38 millimeter so i'm going to pick 38 millimeter from this edge like this 38 millimeter like this then i'm going to draw a straight line from here please make sure it's a faint line now we are given that this place is actually having a radius of 38 millimeter and the diameter we are drawing and the radius we are also picking is also a radius of 38 millimeter so 38 plus 38 which is actually 76 millimeter so from this particular point where this radius line is starting i'm going to be picking 76 millimeter on my on my ruler like this so from this particular point here i'm going to strike an arc like this so picking 30 38 millimeter on my compass like this i'm going to place my compass at this particular point here then draw draw my curve like this like this so now i'm going to be doing exactly the same thing for the upper part also we are giving the upper part to be having a radius of 38 also so i'm going to pick 38 millimeter like this from here making use of faint line i'm going to be drawing very straight line like this so now we are giving the actual place this actual radius of this place is actually 50 millimeter and we are giving the outer radius of this place to be 38 so 38 plus 50 millimeter is 88 millimeter so i'm going to be picking 88 millimeter on my on my compass i'm going to be picking 88 millimeter on my compass like this So from this center point at which we drill our 50 millimeter to strike 88 here yeah, at this point. Now we are giving the radius to be 38 millimeter. So I'm going to pick 38 millimeter on, on my compass also like this. Picking 38 millimeter, I'm going to place it at this point. Then draw. Then draw my arc. So now I'm going to be drawing the straight line like this if you found value in this video please kindly hit the subscribe button do well to share to your friends who also be needing it and comment your idea about this video thanks